Yes or yes. Selling, sir. Like I got 81 of these, you know? Man, that's quite a bit. For things I really don't use, you know? Stormhawk feathers. Who are these guys? Uh, Buddy Horn? Is that good for something? Temporary boost item uh, discovery. Boost immunity, boost fire. Say, I gotta use some of that sometime, huh? Gravity fragments. Use F uh, FP to emit fan shaped gravitational shockwave. I'm never gonna use this stuff, bro. Like, I know my play style. I, I'm never going to use this stuff. I never use little items or handouts like this ever, ever, dude. He has any things I can purchase with all that money? Not finished yet. Hmm. Look at those bolts. Woo. Leather trousers. Scale armor. Demi human mobs. I don't know what that's about. Raises maximum HP. That's kind of cool. The iron helmet. I dodge when I don't know if there's too much shield, but I actually had moments where the boss got knocked back from blocking. That's fucking awesome, bro. I need to get in that life. Kind of want this helmet. Resistance to your armor offers to sleep about the badness. This has eight holy to it. Oh, damage negation. This is a uh, eleven point nine. Is it time for me to leave the rose behind? That's the question. I don't think it is. Definitely time for a helmet though. Pretty sick. Do, do, do. All right, let me go look at our inventory here. We got any uh, the runes? Got five thousand things to spend. How much do we need to level up? Should have thought about that before I bought the helmet. About twelve hundred. Okay. Okay. So we gotta get to that uh, blue post. That's our 
probably where our map's gonna be, right? Dude, look at that castle out there, bro. Dude, this is like reminds me if Game of Thrones made like a uh, open world game like Skyrim, like with George R. R. Martin. I don't know if they were like inspired by his works and how he described it. Oh my God. What is sending it like that? I think I see it. Bro, it's a giant with an arrow, a bow and arrow. Holy moly. Holy, by the way, Zabra Wolf, you fixed my camera, by the way. Shout out to Zabra Wolf. down there holy mackerel Dude, this is so goddamn scary. I'm blowing up on this thing. Why do you say holy mackerel? Why not try to salmon? <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that one hit. Ah, boy, connected. him to walk a little closer. I think when he diagros me, he walks closer. Yeah. Now, all jokes aside, truthfully, because it's it's uh, from uh, grumpy old men. Holy mackerel! There we go, baby! Come on, a little closer. A little closer. We're getting in there though. He's backing up. No, dude, no. Hmm.
Terrible idea, yeah? Terrible idea, terrible idea, terrible idea. Terrible idea. Not the worst idea. Not the worst idea. Okay, that was an awful uh, gameplay moment for me. Get in there! Get in there! We're in, baby. All right, now we know we're right here. I wonder if I find him a little bit. That is not where I wanted to go. Holy fucking moly. Get him. Yeah! Was that a thousand XP? That's not a bad farm right there, no? If he respawns and we go back here? Mm -hmm. So that's see if he respawns or not. It seems like he will. He no response. Cool. Got a new map. All right. Two things. Uh, one, I want to use my inventory here and go use this. This might be give me just enough XP. Yeah. Jesus, I believe. Level up. Level 30, baby. Okay, then, uh, flask here. Added a, far, a flask of the Crimson Tears. Very nice. So now we should have three heals on us. Huge. Massive. All right, what's in here? Anything? All right, there's a little keeper though. Is this the keep the girl wanted me to go to? Cause there's also a keep up here. Castle Morn? Castle Morn lift. Rampart. Oh yeah, so we're supposed to go here. Dude, look at all this over here, man. Dude. So much of this game. fight the boss uh so you fight this boss probably did it faster than i did my body's ready dude this sick Design of these characters. Nice. Nice.
I'm sure I'm on my single bold action here. Part of the map I felt I could get through without dying right away. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I guess I should have came down here before I went forward and to the right, you know? Big boy. Nothing stone. I definitely didn't explore at all before I, I came north, man. Or before I went north to the, defeat Margaret. And I really do wish I would have. I think that's what you're intended to do, really. The game doesn't really give you directions like that. You just kind of have to go with it and wish for the best. Yeah, and I kind of I kind of like that like I like I, I don't think they wanted to give you directions But I think like in the back of their head when they're designing they're like the real way to play is to kind of go south a little bit You know get some XP inside of you Before you have to go after the big boys But also not sure maybe they're like fuck it You know like it, it's like a it's, it's a Like it's, it's a self skill check. Like if you can beat Margaret, you don't need to really go south, right? But if you can't beat Margaret, you gotta take your ass south. And Fuck. Well, that's a lot of XP I think I left behind. You're dead, dead. Yeah, that was not. That is not how we play. Oh, swapped off. We almost went down. Times at four. Stop letting these guys hit me. bro because I'm fighting in here oh, man. all right tell you what let me stand up for a quick minute uh let me go stretch a little bit get, some, get a little bit of water inside of myself and then um we'll head back up do this thing I feel my senses are a little slow Hot second, everyone. All right, back. I think my uh, closest payway could be in PA or MA. Damn. Pretty far.
comment. Everybody. Like me some payway, uh, Thai coconut curry chicken. Bro, I've never been to a payway. I know I got one in the neighborhood. There's one in the neighborhood I can go to. Look at all the races in me. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Well, well, excuse me. I think all Chinese food shops uh, here are local, not chain. This is the way. Thank you, Humdrum. Yeah, I live in a. Um, I live kind of in the. Uh, like I guess Asian district of Orlando. Like there's a lot of like uh, Vietnamese places and stuff open, and Chinese places. And man, so good. Like just being able to like walk down the street and get some like amazing Chinese food. Um, not even Chinese food, there's all kinds. It just like, I take that for granted a little too much. Bro, I thought it was alligator at first. Fuck you. Oh, oh, oh no! No! Oh! God, dude, never send the elevator down, bro. Never send the elevator down again. Terrible advice. Terrible advice. <laughs> it's the best main reason I live in a big city. Uh, it's where the bounty of mountain bomb and bomb food spots. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. One thing I kind of miss in Orlando. Um, is like there, there's a lot of local cool spots that opening up, but like uh, I don't know how else to describe it, but I'm not saying this in a bad way. It's like they're, they're kind of hipster spots, right? Like they're, they're real hip, cool places. What I what I miss in Orlando is that like that like working man spot, you know, that like working person spot where it's like you walk in, you know, you can walk in and six minutes later you walk out with a sack of food. That's delicious. Here it's like, you know, fast service or sit down and check out our cocktails while you wait type of deal. I don't know. I don't know if that's to make, make any sense what I'm saying, if I just sound like an idiot or not. God, we're so fucking dead here. My biggest problem is I always do the hop back on accident. Spot called Perfect Subs. Uh, this squad bread, squad bread is uh, fucking amazing. In and out, five minutes tops. Exactly, bro. In and out. And they don't chart like there's a there's a really good sandwich shop, right? And they make some pretty good sandwiches. But it's like, dude, they charge like fifteen dollars for a sandwich. I'm like, bro, I'm not I'm, like I don't care how amazing your your food is, dude. 